Let's get right to Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez, who is live in Sutherland Springs with an update for us. Kathy, good morning to you. Well, good morning. We know investigators are set to give us an update just in the next 30 minutes. But meanwhile, many people, community members are coming here remembering the 26 victims killed in this very tragic shooting. A Texas tragedy. 26 people shot dead inside the First Baptist Church in Sutherland Springs. Eight of them from the same family, spanning three generations. I knew right away that Carla and Brian were killed. I knew that and I called her and her phone rang and rang and rang. I knew then. The gunman killed the visiting pastor, Brian Holcomb, along with his wife, Carla, their son, Danny, and his 18-month-old daughter, Noah, and his sister-in-law, Crystal, who is pregnant. Her husband, John, did survive, but she and three of her five children did not. Just the worst feeling knowing those individuals and knowing his children and his wife are all gone. And other families shattered. Joanne Ward and her children, Brooke and Emily, killed. Their brother, five-year-old Rylan, shot five times, alive, but fighting for his life. And daughter Rihanna, hit under a pew, a bullet shattered her glasses, but she was spared. Pastor Frank Pomeroy and his wife Sherry were out of town at the time of the shooting. Their daughter, 14-year-old Annabelle, was killed. Pastor Mark Collins was associate pastor at the First Baptist Church for 12 years, now helping in recovery. For the first time, we were able to go to the hospitals and visit, thinking we were going to go and encourage them, and, and they encouraged us. Also helping counselors visiting hospitals and schools. Their next step is they must begin to um, process and plan for funerals and the services that have to happen next. And so helping support them through that making sure families can cope, heal, and overcome. And we know it'll definitely be a tough process for everyone here in this small community. Everyone is absolutely devastated. Again, a press conference will take place here at 1130 and we'll bring it to you live during this newscast. Putting live in Sutherland Springs, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC Channel 2 News.